Hey everybody, your Fiolas here. Welcome back to some more Pokemon Heart Gold. In the last episode, we rescued the director underground. And he told us that we need to get to the very top before Team Rocket does what it's going to do. Whatever it might be. This time we are going to do just that. We are going to finish up the rocket thing. Now then, just going to say this now. Once you finish up this tower, all the Team Rocket grunts will become visible and such yeah so make sure you have already taken them down taking them down downtown so yeah, this will primarily be more more of like an enemy rush and such it feels great ordering Pokemon to, to commit crimes so yeah so anyways all the grunts this episode will be required though it's just all the other optional grunts make sure you take them down now because they will be missable once you take down the boss I think you can probably do it in two embers, unless this guy knows explosion. How you have a wheezing at such a uh, low level, I don't know. Then again, you can also get like slow bros in the 20s, so it doesn't really matter. Or I guess, um, Magmar's in low teens. You're kidding. Wish I was. Is the director safe? I think so. So now with that, we can head upstairs. Why did the door open? Did you have something to do with us? Uh, maybe. Maybe not. Depends on your perspective of who did this. Good sir. Okay, eradicate. Be prepared to get eradicated. I still want to get you up to get you up high enough so you can learn uh, finally a fire type. I think you can learn lava plume at 36. It's pretty good because I'm tired of you having such a non-existent move pool. But I knew when using a magmar, I'd have to go through this trouble. At least your good, at least your somewhat diverse move pool is helpful. Okay, I think you have strength to probably finish this guy off. There we go. And Power Girl 35. Not quite enough, but eh. Go up, this was a bleak moment. Damn right it is. Mom, now is not a good time. Can't you see I'm trying to take oh I'm trying to take back the lighthouse and save the world while well, the radio tower There's better times! Yeah, I swear she's been exceptionally um talkative as of late. So coming up ahead, I think I want to lead. What do I want to lead with? What? I'll lead to Spectra. Spectra could probably sleep this trainer. So up ahead. Now just wait one moment. Aren't you the one who got in our way at Slowpoke Well? I see, you're doing all this because you want to make me angry, be careful. But since you seem to wish it, I'll show you the full extent of a Team Rocket Executive's wrath. So, we are fighting Proton, once again. He's starting with Gold Bat, level 28, and inner focus of the ability with Wing Attack, Confuse Ray, Leech Life, and Bite. I remember in the original in the original games he was like, extremely high level as like he had a goal battle was like in the mid thirties, mid upper thirties, thirty six or thirty eight. So yeah. He is quite literally a fortress. Even though he's not really a fortress. Okay, since I'm confused I wanna swap out because I don't want to be hit with that bite. Uh who's good. I guess I can use you. So yeah, so this gold bat is exceptionally annoying. I might think a payback would be good. Especially if you're gonna go ahead of me. This payback will do a lot more. There we go. Pretty easy. Next up you're setting up Weezing. I think Spectre can probably take it down. Weezing level 33, levitate for the ability, sledge, double hit, smoke screen, and smog. Pretty weak move pool, actually. Seriously, you chase me this far. 
Oh uh, yeah, and I think the Sabian should be able to two-shot you. Since you can't do anything except for smog and a sludge. I think that's good game. And smoke screen that too. Eh, what are you? I am Potato. Hear me roar. There we go, wheezing is done. Woo. Okay, with that done, I think next up I'm gonna use Wallheart next. Um, you know what? I better go ahead and heal up, uh, heal up Pyron because he'll be useful in the next fight. Uh, Pyron, there you are. I reckon, uh, what's his face will be good. Why did I seriously call Wallheart what's his face? Man, I am tired. So right here you get yourselves an Ultra Ball. I will leave you two lovebirds to be. Now coming up here. Go for the observation deck. So up ahead is where the boss is. But first we have Ariana. Hey you, you remember me from the hideout in Mahogany Town? This time. Hee hee hee. This time it looks like you're really all al You are really all alone. All alone. It would be a re it so it should be quite easy. Bring it. Let's finish this. So now we have Ariana next. Oh boy. Ariana, she's starting with Arbok level 32. Intimidate for the ability to move Glare, Crunch, Wrap, and Poison Sting. Ariana is pretty difficult. Especially with that Glare paralyzing your opponents, and yeah. So, Wallheart is pretty much triple now. At least he would be. But then again, Arbox can't do much of anything to Wallheart. Okay, Scratch that, he can do some things. But Payback will be able to be slower, so it will be able to hit hard. Never mind. Um. Go Jawstone, so you can actually get some stab serve. I really need to get something with this throat. This has been a month since I last been ill. I'm still coughing from it. Well, hopefully this will take him downtown. So close, and that glare, man. Ugh. There we go. Okay. Our box gone. Probably it's more intimidating Pokemon, actually. So next up is Vile Plume. Um, well, let's have Sparus. Vile Plume level 32, Chlorophyll for the ability to move Sweet Sin, Mega Drain, Acid, and Sleep Powder. So, yeah. I think a Flash should be able to kill it. Take it down in one hit. There we go. Hopefully that should be it. Nice, good job, good job, Spires. And you grew to 35, nice. When are you gonna learn Drill Pack? Nope, you're gonna learn Assurance. It's not only that good of a move, your opponent's been damaged, deals double damage. Honestly, there's a lot better moves you can use. Finally, Murkrow. What do I wanna do for Murkrow? Well, my two weaker Pokemon are kind of de incapacitated, so I guess I can keep Spires in. Hey, what do you think you're doing? Murkrow, level 32, super locked for the ability with the moves Nightshade, Wing Attack, Astonish, and Pursuit. I think I can go ahead and take to the skies. So... Come on down. There we go. Honchkrow is done. Sorry, Murkrow, not Honchkrow. Honchkrow is not even available for a while. This can't be happening. I fought hard, but I still lost. What a waste. Not not to use your strength to do bad things. <sighs> People like you will never under never in a million years understand our brilliance. 
It's too bad. I've really come to respect your strength. Next up, I strongly suggest you heal. Full heals? Sure. Yes, I'm gonna go ahead and heal up everybody. Because up next is probably the toughest boss in the game so far. Okay. With that, let's go head up the elevator. And now, up here, up ahead, the mysterious blue guy, hit guy with the guy with blue hair. Oh, you managed to get this far. You must be quite the trainer. We intend to take a, the take this radio tower and officially announce our comeback. That should bring our boss Giovanni back from his solitary training. We are going to regain our former glory. I will not allow you to interfere with our. The tissues plans. And now, Team Rocket Executive Archer. He's starting with Hound Hour level 35, early bird for the ability to move faint attack, fire fang, crunch, and roar. I'm definitely gonna try to kill this guy as fast as I can. This guy is far from his most intimidating thing. Okay, one okay, one shot at nice. Okay, what's next? Okay. Coughing, I can live with coughing. Coughing, level 35, levitate for the ability to move sludge, smokescreen, tackle, and haze. So yeah, so this guy is a very good difficulty spike, as in like, these levels are much higher than the other trainers here. It's like, uh, why can the other trainers be this high leveled? Eh, need to have some challenge at the end. Yeah, yeah, go ahead and smoke screen me. Come on! It's like one smoke screen, now everything's missing. Well, that damn Tommy got poisoned. Now, can you actually hit? Thank you. If you just hit in the first place, this wouldn't have happened. And finally, Hound Doom. Dawson, get back out here. His final Pokemon, one of the scariest Pokemon of all, Hound Doom, level 38, early bird for the ability. We can't have you getting in the way before the news of our resurgence against reaches Giovanni. Faint attack, fire fang, bite, and smog. This guy, if you are unprepared, can be very powerful. This guy is very fast and has a very good attack and special attack. Be glad he does not have like like a flamethrower or this flamethrower and dark pulse because that would be a lot deadlier. That's impossible. So as long as I don't get bite locked, it should be good. There we go. GG. I remember having lots of trouble with this guy. But, Dawson Greer level 35. No, forgive me, Giovanni. How could this be? A dream have come to naught. I was not up to the task after all. Like Giovanni has done before, I will disband Team Rocket here today. Farewell. Oh, you have already defeated them. Thank you. Your courageous actions have been have saved Pokemon nationwide. You are well worth this. Here, please take it. We obtained a Rainbow Wing. Or in Pokemon Soul Silver, it would be the Silver Wing. There used to be a tower right here. When the tower was replaced with the Radio Tower, that Rainbow Wing was found at the top of the tower. I heard from a friend in Sinewood say that you can climb the Bellop Tower in Ecrotique City when you have a Rainbow Wing. I have to get back to my office. See you. Oh, I almost forgot. According to my friend from Sinewood City, the legendary Pokemon will not appear if you just go to the top of the bell tower with only that rainbow wing. Apparently there is something else they need, or something like that. I don't wonder what it was. I can't remember. 
or expecting something. This is what they would call a fake out. I really must be getting back to my office this time. See ya. Thank you for for making me flinch. But with that, we have saved the world, pretty much. Yes, I need to go ahead and save this uh poisoning. We have an antidote for that. So we have saved Goldenrod City and the world from Team Galactic's takeover. Honestly, I don't like this new Team Rocket. I've been wanting to see this for a while, but um, Team Rocket's new resurrection is just ugh. It's like they're doing everything they can. Just, they're just all over the place, not really having a clear common goal, just... Honestly, they're bad villains. I don't like the new Team Rocket. So yeah, so anyways, once we're done here, I want to talk to you. Thank you, kiddo, you're the best. Here's a token of my appreciation. We get Team 11 Sunny Day. Pretty good move, actually. It's Sunny Day, it powers up the fire-type moves for a while. That it does. And makes Water Beam charge up in one turn. And now that we have full access to the upper floors, we can go ahead and talk to everybody. There's nothing really... Nothing really of interest here, just some um, people just randomly talking. There, uh, There's Mary. So yeah, that's about it, really. Also, one thing I forgot to do a long time ago. I want to talk to you. Hey, I'm Buena. Do you know about the radio show called Buena's Pass? Where have you... Yes, I forgot about this a whole long time ago. We obtained point card. You're able to get many rewards up to 30 times. You can you can get 30 passwords in about 30 years or so. And you're able to get up to a rare candy. Honestly, the rewards are not good, so I was kind of skipping out on them. Yeah, that's why I never really went over. I mean, sure, you're able to get enough to get a rare, to get a, a rare candy, but then the numbers reset, and yeah. So, you've saved the town. Yeah, sure. Am I a winner? Or am I a wiener? Nope. Darn. But with that, we have saved Goldenrod City. The NPCs are back to normal. And, yeah. Now then, even though we do have the Rainbow Wing, I'm not going to scale um, the uh, tower. The bell tower, because I want to save that for when we actually do have a first go up there. Much like the World Islands, you will not be able to do a kind of little Pokemon that's supposed to be there for a while. Just you can finally go down to the lower parts and get yourself the rare candy. That's about it for the lower part, so that's why I went over the World Islands already, and yeah. So, we've managed to do everything we can possibly in the region. Except, there's one more city, and one more gym, in Blackthorn City. Next time in Pokemon Heart Gold, we make our way towards Blackthorn City. See you guys then!